we are looking at predefined functional interfaces and in this video we are going to cover our second functional interface which is supplier supplier functional interface has only one abstract method and this method does not take any input argument but it returns any type of object so if you see here supplier of t that means it can return any type of object but it does not need to take any input argument if you consider this example here this is a supplier of employee because this is returning an object of employee if you see the lambda here it is returning an object of employee that's why it is a supplier of employee and if you see here we do not take any input argument in the lambda the important thing to note here in supplier interface is when we write a lambda for supplier interface it should not take any input argument but it should return any type of object let's see an example for supplier interface so if you see here we have a supplier of double that means this supplier is going to return us the value of double and this supplier is a random number generator that means it returns a random double value okay and if you see here it does not take any input argument so this lambda here does not take any input argument but it returns a value of double type and if you want to know more about random method this random is a static method in math class and it returns us a random double value we are using streams api to generate stream of elements okay and to generate stream of elements in streams api we have one method called as generate and this generate method takes supplier so if someone asks you which streams api takes supplier as its input argument then the answer is stream dot generate the generate method takes the supplier and can generate elements now we are using a random number generator to generate element of streams and we are using limit so that we can limit the number of elements to be generated so here what we are doing is we are generating five stream elements using our supplier okay and then we are collecting it to a list so if i run this program what i'll get is list of five elements and these elements are double values because math that random gives us a random double value every time okay and now if i change it from random number generator to fix number generator and we change mat.random to fix number that is 2.55 and we try and run this program then i'll get a list of five elements but this time we are getting the same number because our supplier is supplying same value every time and our generator takes this supplier and generate streams from those fixed numbers and this is the simplest functional interface in all the predefined functional interfaces in java so that is all about supplier thank you have a great day bye bye